when we think of the Jerusalem temple we all remember the great king Solomon who built it but have you ever heard about a man named Arona and the role he played in building the Jerusalem temple come let us learn it the bible introduces Arona or Orman the Jebusite as an owner of a threshing floor the name Arona means lord the story of Arona is recorded in the second book of Samuel chapter 24 and in the first book of Chronicles chapter 21 the story goes in this way contrary to the law king david had ordered a census of the troops of israel the punishment god sent for the sin was a plague on the land of israel almost 70000 people from dan to bersheba lost their lives king david asked god how the plague could be stopped the lord through his prophet god ordered david to build an altar on the threshing floor of arona king david approached arona to buy the property arona being a humble and a god fearing person who wished to give the land as an offering to the lord and the king he was even prepared to supply the oxen for the sacrifice however king david insisted on paying for the land as he did not want to make a sacrifice to the lord that cost him nothing david later built the altar and sacrificed the offering there at once the plague on the people was stopped so how is it connected with the jerusalem temple well the second book of chronicles chapter 3 verse 1 says that it is on the same threshing floor king solomon later built the temple of jerusalem arona could not have imagined in his desire to serve david and the lord almighty that one day the temple would be built on his threshing floor arona was ready to sacrifice what belonged to him for the service of the lord and the safety of his nation friends amidst this pandemic let us model arona and engage in such small acts of sacrifice god will surely remember and bless it for a higher cause do subscribe our channel for more videos press the like button and share this message among your friends goodbye